Plus One News Now. Now to a story of strength. A man from Westchester suffered a stroke at just 37 years old. Yeah, he couldn't do things many people take for granted. But now he's back to work and even driving, as well as giving back to those he's met on his road to recovery. Files One's Christina Chiarelli has the story. Brad Berman was always an athlete, but he didn't become a runner until meeting his wife, Jessica. She liked running and introduced me to it. So, like, the way I felt about it was, you know, if she liked it, I wanted to like it too. Brad liked it so much that he began running marathons. Then, one day before a training run, he had a stroke at only 37, losing all feeling in the left side of his body. There were no warning signs. He actually had a malformation of blood vessels that bled in his brain. That's what caused his stroke. Mm -hmm. He didn't know that he had that. It was 100% asymptomatic. Brad was in a coma for four weeks and spent four months in four hospitals. Then he started therapy at Burke Rehabilitation Center, learning how to breathe, eat, walk, and talk again. The piece of me that liked, you know, long distance running, liked the challenge, and like still, you know, pushes me now. Burke uses robotics to help patients recover. Brad and Jessica have raised over $600,000 through their foundation, Run for Brad, to fund lower limb technology, the first of its kind at the center. For people who can't walk properly after their uh, neurological injury, uh, to engage in uh, regular physical activity in a controlled environment uh, and make them more independent at home. This month, Brad and Jessica will receive an award from Burke not only for the money they've raised, but also for the example they set for other patients and families. It's a big deal for our family. <laughs> like a runner who takes a journey, Brad has come a long way. Treadmill workouts in my house, I'm taking nice walks with my kids, I'm driving them places. It's a miracle. With his wife, two boys, and close friends cheering him on. In White Plains, Christina Chiarelli, Fios, One News.